Now, Utah tested more than 2,000 people for COVID-19 yesterday alone. And relatively few of those tests came back positive. Fox 13's Max Roth joins us with a look at some of the overall indicators of how Utah is poised for this pandemic. Max. Yeah, we're going to be looking at good and bad things. And you know that testing, Utah is testing a lot more people than most states. Utah has some characteristics that are already helping us when it comes to weathering this storm, but that should not give us false confidence. Let's look at the facts. Some really good things about Utah that lead to some bad things about Utah. The good to begin with, we are young and healthy. Let me show you, I'll shrink myself into the corner here and then go to the charts. First of all, you see right here, Utah is ranked fifth on America's health rankings. Uh, so the fifth healthiest state overall. And then when you look at some things that help with a respiratory condition, we have the lowest cigarette use in the country, again by far. California has about 11% use and see we're just under 9%. So really good there. We're the youngest state in the country by far with this disease, that does matter. You see Alaska is next four and a half years on a median basis uh, older, DC, not a state, but they're at 34 years, the closest to us in median age. So what does that mean? It means maybe we feel a little too invincible. We don't have as much insurance as most states, 34th in the country, despite being a thriving economy compared to most states. So some people may be reluctant to seek help early. And we don't have as many hospital beds because normally we don't need them. See, we're 47th in Utah with 1.8 beds per thousand people in the population. And that's why we have to keep these numbers down with all these steps we're taking. So another thing that does seem counterintuitive about Utah, we are a big space by geography. So we think we're kind of a rural state, a country state. But you know what? We're not. The population is not spread out. Utah has the ninth highest level of urban density in the country. We are all packed together. And that's not so good when it comes to contagious diseases. Live in the newsroom, Max Roth, Fox 13 News, Utah.